Prime members back with a weekly video here. Got uh, a bunker shot here on hole number three. And with the rain that we've had uh, this week, this morning, and, and coming up through the last couple weeks, you start to see our bunkers get pretty firm when we don't have a chance to get in and rake them in the morning because it's been, been raining. So a couple of things that, that come into play that are different when you're hitting a bunker shot out of wet and firm sand. Um, typically when we come in to this bunker shot, we're going to really open this club face, okay? Out of this wet sand, that's probably not going to work quite as much. What, what happens when we open that club face is we set that bounce, we open that club face wide open and use a lot of the bounce. Well, when we're in a wet bunker, it's harder to get into that sand with the, the sand so wet. So when we open that club, a lot of the times we won't get down into the sand and we'll hit it thin. Okay, so when we have these wet lies here in these bunkers, we want to keep the club face a little bit more square. Get our body more set up square instead of having it be really open and the club face open. We're going to body a little bit more square, club face a little bit more square, and then make sure that we still are focused on hitting about an inch to two inches behind that ball. Make sure that we swing through the shot. So a little bit more square, not open like this, a little more square, nice long and smooth swing, and make sure I swing through that ball and get that ball to pop out. It's going to run a little bit more than it will when you have that club face open. So when we're in these bunkers, these tight lies in the bunkers, this one's on number three, but when it rains like this, we'll get them in all of our bunkers. Square that club face up, square your body up, hit it a little bit more like a regular shot, still trying to hit about an inch behind the ball and dig right down under that ball and swing through.